Thank you all so much for pulling this together so quickly. I really want to get it out as soon as possible. Oh, can I read them the new ending? Oh, I'm not sure that. He inspired it. He made a joke that he was my consolation prize after the whole Senate debacle. Here, listen to this. Um, why don't we save it for the copy edit? Oh, he's so shy. <laughs> the gentlest warriors always carry the biggest swords. So. <laughs> Liza, Claw would have been a much better book if I'd listened to your notes, so I'm listening now. I'd be happy to. Uh, we have some more editorial notes to review, but why don't we do that in my office? Of course, and thanks, Liza. Here's this. Is how go. You handled that so much better than I would if someone was talking about my ex's sword in a meeting. You do not have to read that book. Oh, no. It's well written. I mean, even if a lot of it sounds like bullshit. Well, it's a book about failure written by a billionaire. Of course it's bullshit. But these stories that she tells, they sound phony. I mean, is anyone really going to believe that Pope Benedict consulted her about admitting female clergy? Well, Charles is editing the book. Maybe we just let him worry about it. Yeah, but he's not seeing things clearly because they're whatever they are. OK, he, he's not seeing things clearly? This has nothing to do with us. Naomi Wolf's last book got canceled when they found out that it was full of factual errors. Her publisher lost a ton of money. Quinn has already hired a third party fact checker. And she's never forged anything before, has she? Are we just going to sit by while the woman who almost bankrupted our company once and besmirched our reputation threatens to do it again? <sighs> okay, Liza, I want you to know that I recognize your passion, okay? I respect it and I fear it. Okay, ignore her, ignore this, okay? It's Charles's problem now. Not yours. <sighs> okay. And this story about Elizabeth Warren telling Quinn she's one of the good billionaires is both politically volatile and provably inaccurate. Elizabeth Warren categorically says the existence of billionaires is immoral. Also... Liza, I need to apologize to you for what happened in the meeting. I can't imagine a worse way for you to find that out. I'd already seen it in page six. That's definitely worse. I'm sorry. You know what? It's none of my business. Let's just keep it to the book. Why don't I just fact check some of these? You're still not sold. Quinn is a controversial author. People will already be dubious that she's turned over a new leaf. OK. So let me know what you find. Great. I will report any red flags for the book. I meant for the book. I have got to go. I'm late for a, a thing. So here's a chair.